going on, guys? I'm about to talk about Jelly Roll. I know. I know. A lot of people, they get upset with me because I speak about Jelly Roll. I don't care. <laughs> I don't give a damn. I like his music. I think that it's super dope. Had a lot of potential back in the day, and now we're seeing where the potential led. But, yeah, this, this ain't it, dog. This ain't it, fam. And let me show you guys what I'm speaking on. I've been saying that I believe and think that he might have become a sellout. A lot of people have been upset because you saw. You super soft, right? You can't handle people having difference in opinions, right? But if you can see this, let's make it full screen, actually. Let's make this full screen. Guys, and don't forget to follow me on... Say it with me. Go ahead. Why are you fronting? Instagram. Come on, man. You knew what it was. You knew what it was. Shout outs to Kansas Rebel, man. Right? That's the homie right there. Right? You representing Fang Gang News or... Fang News Network. Anyway, we, we we picking a name soon. Don't be hating. Don't be hating. But he uh put me on his information via Instagram where it states, country is the biggest and coolest it's ever been. Morgan Wallen and Zach Bryan are, to me, doing it by themselves. Y use a damn liar, Jelly Roll. That, that was Jelly Roll saying that. Word. What? For real? Like, just those two? That sounds crazy, bro. It sounds untrue. It sounds like you're being kind of like maybe even bitter or petty towards someone. But that's like super shady. All the other people that's out here doing country, right? Especially the independents. You got people like Upchurch. Out here killing it. JJ Long. Killing it. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I'm going to do a video essay that describes why Jelly Roll might be throwing shade that way. But this is how you feel, Jelly? So you feel. Let me read what Kansas uh, Rebel Man had to say. Jelly Bean. <laughs> Am I reading that right? Jelly Bean says Morgan Wallen and Zach Bryan are responsible for country music's popularity during a recent appearance on Full Send Podcast. What a goofball. I agree. Ma'am, I know a lot of people are going to hate me. They're going to get mad. They're going to be upset. The, I, did I click the... I clicked the same thing about... <laughs> oh, wait, did I just click? I had the second... Look at it one more time. Wait, did it? Ah. I'm old. I'm sorry, bear with me. It's because I didn't have a mouse pad. All right. Crazy part is, I'm not going to edit that out either. We real rap raw over here. Bang, gang. Um, but yeah. Yeah, like this dude be high. That's. Absolutely. It's kind of my thing. Just not meeting me. But yeah, fam, I believe that, uh, talk about a little bit more. I believe that Jelly Roll is out of pocket. You can see even in the comment section, that's what I said. I believe he's tweaking. I think that he's tripping, right? And it got to be something behind this. It got to be something. Something behind this isn't just no normal. Oh, I'm gonna give credit to whoever he said, Morgan Wallen, Zach Bryan. They're not, nah, it's not just you giving credit to them. Maybe it's your team, maybe it's the people that represent you. Maybe they're telling you that you should maybe promote certain people and rep this certain agenda. Maybe it's the system. I don't want to go too hard on him. I know there's going to be a few people that's like, no, no, please do. Please do. But there's going to be other people crying. Like, please don't. I'm not going to not go hard on him. Pause for you cry babies. It's more so because I don't have any personal hate or disdain. Jelly roll. Ah. 
Why would I, why would I be mad at him? Right? I, does he stand for what I stand for? No. But I learned a long time, a long time ago, that you should never, never expect people to do the same thing that you're doing. I'm a real one. Jelly Roll making fake one moves out here, fam. I don't like that. And this ain't the first time he's done this. This has to be some kind of shade towards not only Upchurch, but a lot of other people that's out here that strain the game when it comes to country, country rap. But now it's just all these, these all. Only reason why people know. The only reason why people know country. I got to keep looking at the, to see their names. Moyen Wallen and Zach Bryan. Jelly Roll. I don't want you to take no offense when I say this. And I want you to actually think about it before you answer. You drunk? You drunk? You having a little sip? I'm not judging you. I'm not judging. Did you? Did you? And then go on a podcast? What was you? Drunken master? <laughs> this guy is wild. Straight wilding out here, fam. In the interview, we're just letting that rock too. By themselves. It's disrespectful, fam, and it's blatant. And it gotta be shade that he's throwing out there on purpose. I don't care what nobody say. I don't care how mad people get. It's not only just my opinion, but it seems like it, it might be the truth. But wait, I was crazy, right? All the other videos, I bet you're going to go back and watch those previous videos on my channel, BXB Spoiler Extra. You could tune in. There's no camera over there yet. We working on it. We work. I'm going to have a whole setup. You over here judging me. Stop hating. It's going to be a whole setup. I'm going to get a sign and anything. Don't you? Why are you worried? Don't worry about me. Just know I ain't out here jelly rolling. Or as Rebel Man would say, jelly bean and let me take this off the screen. Jelly bean in there. Dude, out here wildin', bro. But I think that uh Jelly is a little bit upset. I think he's kind of hot and bothered. Right, by maybe some previous situations that I will be speaking on and giving a breakdown to. Definitely gonna be doing that on my main channel, BXB Boy. Go and check that out. But um, this is too crazy to me. It was an extreme amount of shade, and I think that he was wilding. Tell me what you guys think down in the comment section. Maybe I'm tripping. Maybe I'm tripping. I'm not tripping.